Is Boris Johnson a liar? Was Guy Fawkes really the last person to enter Parliament with honest intentions? In my opinion, there's definitely a leadership failure here, but more worryingly, the impact of a toxic culture is evident from the recent reports. Misleading accounts of what actually happened, zero respect for the cleaners and security guards, bullying normalised despite grievances raised by members of staff, and no regard for the rules. Drinking and partying in close proximity whilst we were all being told to stay home and save lives. If this happened in a business, there would be serious impact on other success factors. And the same is true here when you consider the amount of time that's currently been taken up by the Partygate inquiry and all those involved, including the Prime Minister, the Met Police, other members of Parliament and the media. And that time could most certainly be better spent elsewhere. Now, this does happen in business a lot more often than we think, perhaps not to the, uh, to the extent of Partygate and perhaps not to the extent of such a toxic culture. But every time that time is spent dealing with challenges that could have been avoided through strengthening the culture, the business is missing out on opportunities to discuss strategy, to discuss innovation and to discuss driving the business forward, as opposed to dealing with issues that could have been avoided by investing in the leadership and the culture of the business. So, could Partygate have been avoided? Should it have been avoided? And is Boris Johnson really a liar? Love to hear your thoughts.